Hello friends, welcome to my channel, a channel for learning simple coding. If you find this video to be helpful, please like, share and subscribe my channel. In this video, we are going to learn how we can re-enable auto import facility of VS code for Go language. Just see an example, suppose I write some code and you see in this code, we, I do not have the empty package import. So just I press Ctrl S, automatically VS code import this package. But my some viewers are saying that they are not having such kind of facility in their VS code. And for that I made one video also, if you search on YouTube, Dr. Vipin class auto import. So I have explained how you can re-enable this. And you can go here in Golang series, beginning to advance and here in 36 video, the same video you can also run from here. But the viewer, those have applied this setting, still they having a problem. They are saying that this setting is not working on their VS code. So I am giving a one more video on this concept. Here in my VS code running perfectly without any problem. But this auto import disable whenever we do some kind of mistakes. What kind of mistake that if suppose I go to setting and in setting, I just uh, uh, type here use server setting like this. So this is checked here. So by some reason if I say unchecked or I do some other type of mistakes here and uh, now I just close this and restart again VS code or we do some other kind of wrong setting maybe anything. So we go there. Now once again I try to implement this code here and I say control S. You see now this import is not working in my machine also, in my PC also. You see, once again I show you that if I do some wrong setting, so I say main import plus you see now I am not able to import this automatically. Because I do some wrong setting, some wrong tick and click and because of that my setting is disturbed. So the solution is a Ramban type of solution that will work on each and every user that first of all we have to go to the setting. Setting is already open here. So here we uh, need to uh, click on uh, go P PLS then we will have this setting click on this and remember that here we having a go setting this go setting we have. So select this and remove, remember do not use any line of code that start with go, remember do not use any line of code that is start with go means in here in my file I have a two line of code go, go pls. So you have to remove each and every line those are begin with go. Similarly I have two line I remove this, maybe in your uh, uh, your your VS code 100 lines are there, 10 lines are there, 4 lines are there. So remove this setting, do not use this. Then close this setting. One more thing you have to do, control, shift and P. You have to press and here we have a Golang develop, install and develop tool. Click on this, select all and OK. So it will install all the plugin that is required for VS code to work properly. So install the latest plugin, remove the go lines from the setting.json file. These are two steps that you need to follow. Now you see it is installed properly. So after this installation, just close it, open once again. Now I remove this code, again I try to insert this code, you see. I insert this code and try control S, you see automatically my import is working. Remember, it was not working previously, but now my auto import is working again. You see, I close it, again I insert the code, no package import is there, just control S, automatically package is import. So you have to remove the lines of code from the setting.json file. You have to install all the plugins by pressing Ctrl, Shift and P. That's all. 
in this video if you like please do subscribe thank you for watching this video